Hello, and welcome to a weekly bench update. We got a jam packed episode for you this week. Everything from future shows, videos, stash ads, supplies, what's going on on the bench, and more. So let's kick it off. Call this like a show shout outs. My next show appearance will be at the Back to the 50s event in St. Paul, Minnesota, which is running June 21st through the 23rd. Of course, there is a model car event, but more importantly, this is part of a monster of a one-to-one -one show. For those that don't know, the Back to the 50s show is a one-to-one -one car show, pre-64 vehicles only, and there is in the neighborhood of 10,000 plus entries that go to this event at the state fairgrounds. So again, it is a monster of a car show, and this being the 50th anniversary, I expect it to be a stellar, stellar event. This is my first time going for the model car show, which should be a blast, and it's been some time since I've been there for the one-to-one -one event. So I'm really looking forward to this. Should be an exciting weekend. So if you're anywhere close by uh, and you want to check out some one-to-ones or the model car shows, make sure to go check out the Back to the 50s event at the Minnesota State Fairgrounds. The next show to talk about is an exciting one because it is a model car show that I am hosting, again in conjunction with a one-to-one -one show, and that is at the South Shore Show and Shine, South Shore, South Dakota, held July 6th. The car show and activities happen on Main Street. The model car show is going to be in the community center, which is right on Main Street. So it's just off the sidewalk, in through a door, and you're at the model car show. Again, this is going to be an exciting, uh, it's the first time for a model car event for them. First one I will ever be hosting. So a lot of anxiety, a lot of excitement going along with this one. Don't know what to expect. So as far as the car classes, we're just going to do it by ages. We're going to do like a youth, a teen, adult. I'll also have some space for some miscellaneous models. If you want to bring some planes or tanks, Gundam, figurines, whatever, I will also have kind of a, a show display area along with all of my builds. I will have a large host display, so nothing else. You'll be able to come check out my builds in person there. I will also have... Some for sale stuff there to kind of uh, spark off a swap meet area in conjunction with the show. Hopefully we can grow this into a nice little show there in South Shore, South Dakota, July 6th. If you can make it, I would love to see you guys come support both the one-to-one -one and the model car show. So now let's talk about what we have going on in front of us on the bench here. Uh, a lot of this we kind of talked about in the last kind of uh, status of the channel update. Up front we've got a $56 A in black and gold. This is a spray paint job. I did a little how-to kind of uh, how to paint, uh, spray paint, custom painting video that I have uh, wrapped up now. It is just waiting to be released. I expect to also be releasing the final on the 60 Apache pickup build, buddy build with Sean over at the Scale Model Car Guy channel. My video is ready to go. Whenever he gets a chance to put out his final video, I will release mine as well. So you guys get them back to back there. And uh, I expect this weekend, if not uh, sometime soon, and then a few days there for the spray paint video. Over in the left-hand corner, we have a couple of bodies. We've got a 65 Chevelle AFX. Just did the box opening on that. And then we've got the 65 Nova. This is the Mobius Gaster. And I'm getting these prepped up for the lace painting video. So there'll be another video coming out in the next few weeks. Uh, maybe like two to four weeks before we get that one. I'll be working on it. But then we've got the other shows going on. So hopefully maybe in the next uh, month or so you guys will be seeing that lace video. If you guys have any ideas for that patterns and lace video, make sure to get a hold of me. Again, we are getting ready, we're getting the bodies prepped. I'm getting some extra spray out cards so we can do a few different styles of lace in one video. So now moving on to like stash ads and supplies. We'll start over here. We got a baggie in from Eric over at Eric's Model Car Garage. Uh, he had just finished up the Cadillac from Johan. 
it had some of these custom parts. I just reached out to him, asked him what he was going to do with them, if he wanted to sell them or trade them or whatever. And he said he had no plans for them, so he would get them my way. So it's exciting to get some of these custom parts from those early Johan customizing kits. I don't currently have a Cadillac, but now that I've got the customizing parts, I can go out and search one instead of hunting down the more expensive flat boxes or customizing kits. So again, exciting to get these kind of rarish customizing parts and hopefully we've got a custom Cadillac in the near future. So again, Eric, thanks for that. I've got a few things off in the mail for him. Next up for Stash Yeds, we've got the Model Cars Magazine. We got the subscription to this. We got this in a week or two ago, but just wanted to show that off. It's always nice to promote the Model Car Magazines. Again, speaking of magazines, want to uh, let you guys know that I have kind of changed up my channel. I've started a new channel for my vintage magazine uh, episodes. They're all moving to a separate channel. If you guys enjoy the vintage magazines, make sure you get over there and subscribe. It's just Sodak Model Cars 2. I have an alternate channel there. So if you want to see kind of the same stuff that you've been seeing over the last couple years, make sure you subscribe. Your feed will appear the same. If you guys aren't into the vintage magazine, it's now going to be gone off of your feed. So if you want to get into that, make sure to subscribe. Please go support that channel so we can keep the vintage magazines coming. So again, support your magazines. There is another magazine coming out in the near future that I hope to check out. Supplies, we picked up a few random bits. We finally got in some of the Chrome Spray or the Revell Chrome Spray. Uh, it's been quite the rage as far as Chrome Spray. Have yet to check this out, but uh, excited to finally get this in hand and see what it's like first person. Next up, we ordered some stuff from Green Stuff World. I needed some tape. We're going to be doing some custom, more custom painting in the future. So I picked up a couple of each. I like their uh, matching tape for curves or their vinyl tape. We got one millimeter, two millimeter, three millimeter, five millimeter, and up to eight millimeter. And the vinyl tapes, I got a couple of each of those. Nice little restock. I have a variety of tapes and along with the tapes i decided to pick up a bunch of their color shift i do enjoy color shift paints so we've got a red goblin we've got the evil forest martian green nebula copper storm surge green and burning gold the burning gold i do have plans to use this for the senior build, I do have a Boot Hill Express. I've been working on stripping it, trying to get all of the old paint out of the nooks and crannies. I think uh, we might be using some of this burning gold, and we'll get more into that on that video. So a little resupply there from Green Stuff World. I've had a few of their products in the future, and always had uh, been happy with those. And last over here, a little stash ad. This comes via trade. Somebody was uh, looking to trade this out on Facebook. It is just uh, new inside. Open, open box, but all new plastic inside. I'm excited to get one of these. Uh, I do have a couple of the surf sharks, but to get the, the full-on ambulance with all the other goodies is uh, exciting. We'll get that on. We do have like a 59 hearse. Again, the surf sharks we have a couple of the other caddies so we have a whole fleet of 59 cadillacs uh, coming in the future so excited to get that one into the stash and now to what's going on on the bench the only project really going on right now is the old tom rambler 69 appreciation bill just getting that one wrapped up uh we had some hiccups with the front axle everybody knows those finicky dragsters i think i broke that front axle off three or four times Decided to just uh, kind of tear it all down, strip it, uh, rebuild it, and uh, get it re-chromed. So I've been working on all of that, finishing up some details. So again, in another week or two, we should have a final coming out on the old Tom. The next project up on the bench will likely be the senior tribute build with that boot hill express again still working on stripping some of those parts i didn't realize that it was previously painted for some of it but get that cleaned up and get that project going on the bench for that tribute and then we're kind of uh on to like the lace videos and all that 
And I think that will wrap it up for this video. Got a lot going on, a lot of exciting videos coming out. We got the spray painting video, we got the final on the 60s Apache. The latest video will be out shortly, and then the old Tom video. So again, we got a lot of stuff coming right around the bend. Uh, make sure you guys go support your local shows if you can. I'm really excited about the next coming shows. Again, the Back to the 50s and the South Shore Show and Shine, July 6th. Uh, I would love to see you guys in person if you are local enough to come. And with that, we'll see you next time.